a regular sequence or something that repeats over and over again. I think patterns are sort of always changing, you know, ever developing. You look at the accelerometer on your phone um, while, you while you're walking, you'll see a wave. This, this is done by her who must be obeyed and this is superior to all other patterns. We have seven days in the week, we have 24 hours in a day. I can't imagine a world without patterns. Without any patterns, it's almost impossible to imagine human life. Life in itself is a form of pattern of, of coherence and of regularity. Yeah, you get these really, really beautiful patterns, especially at early embryonic stages. We think about our DNA at the smallest level. It's such a beautiful and complex structure. It seems incredible that such a complicated thing could be inside every single one of our cells. I think the whole kind of genius of genetics and biology is that the pattern doesn't come from an external source, it's generated from miniature instructions. By bringing in artists to work with Crick scientists, we created a whole new way of experiencing and viewing patterns. When your hands form, it's all one tissue. You have cells that are going to become fingers and cells that are going to die uh, in between, and that's how we get this striped pattern. Even the viruses and things that can make you very sick, we look at them just aesthetically, they're just very beautiful things to look at.